Thanks for checking it as we take a look at your extreme weather outlook. I'm meteorologist Todd Nelson. We're talking about a rare high risk of severe weather today in the plains. We'll talk about the specifics regarding that. Another major winter storm unfolding here across the Rockies with some heavy snowfall and some record heat, of course, in the eastern U.S. But there's your high risk of severe weather today. We also have a slight risk over the eastern Great Lakes. But again, this is our fourth high risk so far this year. It's actually the most in one year since 2011. 2011, we actually had five high-risk days. Uh, years with five or more high-risk days, pretty rare since 1984. Again, the uh, most recent here back in 2011. We had also in 2010 and uh, dating back to 1991 as well. So uh, this high-risk area, again, is an area that we're going to be very concerned with. Large, long-track tornadoes, possibly EF2 or greater. So a very good chance at seeing that. Damaging winds, large hill, also a possibility. Could be talking as uh, large is two to maybe even four inch in diameter. And then that damaging wind threat takes us into the late afternoon and evening hours. So this is all on the eastern flank of that big snow event taking place over the central Rockies. Again, once we head into the late afternoon and evening, thunderstorms quickly and rapidly develop, uh, watching for some large shale, damaging winds and tornadoes. And then that damaging wind threat takes us into the overnight hours as it slides closer to the Mississippi River Valley. So again, that severe threat continues on Friday with another enhanced threat. And then on Saturday, lessens a little bit at this point at some marginal risk. Now, as you take a look at the rainfall, could be seeing anywhere from one to three plus inch liquid tallies, a little bit less to the far north, but uh, still some very heavy uh, rainfall there. So there's your storm system winding up in the colder sector of this system. Yellowstone, Wyoming, seeing some snowfall and a number of winter weather headlines. In fact, Denver under a winter storm watch, Cheyenne, Wyoming under a winter storm warning. Some spots here could be talking about one to nearly three feet of snow by the time this winds up late week.